Yo. What up? Hey. Um, so uh we got another family guy cutaway compilation. Hmm. Okay. Okay. Family guy. Family guy. Family guy. The cutaway compilation might be <laughs> the funniest part of Family Guy. <laughs> <laughs> definitely, definitely, man. Who doesn't love the cutaway? You know? You ready? Yeah, I built it after I got bored with that European sea and say. The pig goes wank. The cow goes shazoo. It most certainly does not. <laughs> the rooster goes kikriki. Where? Where does the rooster say that? The monkey goes macaque. Oh no no no! <laughs> it does not. The elephant goes fwap. Oh, yeah, kind of. <laughs> it's not the dog he used to be, and I'll have to get used to it. Just like I got used to my acrylic nails. <laughs> Stanion, Weinstock, and Reisman. <laughs> hey, LaRonda. <laughs> now, I got four people on hold, but I can't talk. <laughs> we can't have sex? Uh, no. Uh. <laughs> Peter, we're married. Tony Randall was married, Lois. Rock Hudson was married. Ronald Reagan was married. Mr. President, did you reach a missile pact? Well, you could say that. There was a missile, and something definitely got packed. <laughs> <laughs> Good, you're more out of place than Prince was on The Price is Right. Uh -huh. And what's your bid on the dining room set, Prince? 350. I'm sorry? <laughs> Can you speak up, please? 350. <laughs> All right, and the actual retail price of the dining room set is three hundred fifty dollars. <laughs> After we eat, we can watch that YouTube footage of Miley Matlin calling movie phone. Please say the name of the movie you'd like to see now. The last meme team. I'm sorry, I didn't catch that. Please say the name of the movie you'd like to see now. The last. Mimti. You have selected 300. If this is the movie you'd like to see, say yes now. No. You have confirmed 300. None of this is awkward. I've moved on from Jillian. I've dated plenty of other girls since her. I never do computer dating. Yeah, me neither. So you're 27? Well, that, that picture was, you know, it was posted a couple of years ago. So, so you're you're a golden retriever. Well, it's a retriever <laughs> mix, Chesapeake Bay, Bradoodle. Where, where is that waitress? Perfect. Now I won't have to take that job as Matt Damon's neck. Hey, Matt. <laughs> Matt. Hey, is this another one of those movies where you're an educated Boston street tough? I don't have to take that crap from you, Neck. Oh, you have to, uh... my friend. I'm your neck. What are you gonna do? Choke me? You'll die. You'll die if you do that. Can somebody from wardrobe get me a scarf? Oh, I'm still gonna... I'll just talk louder. Uh... Ben Affleck married Jennifer Garner, but you married a bartender with a kid. <laughs> what? God, I hate cops. Almost as much as I hated my overly sensitive car alarm. <laughs> and you better be responsible tonight. I don't want a repeat of the last time I left you alone with one of our children. <gasps> it's just so horrible. I'm sorry, Lois. <laughs> Peter I Griffin if I Jr. Shook him enough, he'd stop crying. <laughs> I was kind of right. <laughs> You're gonna fail faster than John Madden's wedding video business. Boom, here's your groom over here. Boom, you got your bride right here. And a lot of people say that Stacy's no good and that she slept with this guy and done that guy and even this guy. But I'll tell you something, that experience is gonna work in her favor late in the game. You know what a heck of a wedding? Brett Favre. So Lauren, do you and Paris Hilton and Lindsay Lohan all hang out and go drunk driving together? I heard that Lindsay Lohan wasn't driving that night. She was taking the rap for a friend. Roadhog! Oh no, I already have two strikes! I'll take the wheel, Mr. Magoo. I'm too old to go to prison. They'll rape me, and I'll never <laughs> see him coming, no, I won't. Well, it sure is odd. A record doesn't just get up and walk away. Except for my old Alan Sherman record. 
If you ain't gonna play me, don't complain when I try to split. There's a lot of Jews out there still get a laugh off of Hello Mother, Hello Father. Ooh, such heat this morning. I don't need this jacket. Why would she go out with me? She must be more drunk than Santa Claus when he got that DUI. Oh, no, it wasn't my fault. Some guy out of Plymouth totally cut me off. Sir, they don't make Plymouths anymore. Are you Jewish? Sir, I'm gonna need you to step out of the sleigh. <laughs> this is gonna be a bigger pain in the ass than getting into a last clap contest with Cleveland. Ladies and gentlemen, the Quahog Men's Chorus. Clap one more time, you're not coming to my birthday. <laughs> Who did that? I want to thank you all for coming out here today. We got a serious situation down in the Bronx. Our friend needs to get a message to the short man in the hat. He needs to deliver this message before the construction site contracts are handed down. It's of vital importance that these matters be attended to. So we may have to bring in a friend from Yonkers. What? Uh, I say we may have to bring in a friend from Yonkers. <laughs> they always play that music. Ah, <laughs> uh, uh, <laughs> you always hear that music in <laughs> like those mob type uh, movies. Jesus, <laughs> gangster type movies. Ah, <laughs> uh, shit, yeah. Yeah, man, it shows the king of the cutaways. King of... 